This block to me, well for me, it just brings back so many memories for me as a child growing up here and it's really, I feel like it's my foundation. This is my grandparents, it's their house, uh, so we always spent time growing up here and actually lived here a lot of our childhood as well. So just, like I even learned to drive on this block. So it's like just so many like memorable things have happened here. But we are at Ladera Park, the infamous Ladera Park, which is right down the block from uh, the block I grew up on. What's also interesting about this park is that the very first girls group that I was in, um, I was 10 or 11 and we were like, you know, we were signed and the first video we ever shot was actually at this park. Yeah, I started dancing probably around the age of five and that's pretty much all I remember about my childhood kind of, it's just like dancing, but I love to do it because I had like a lot of, well I still do have like way too much energy for one person. <laughs> so my mother was like, yeah, you need to channel this into something productive. Make a shot for me. <laughs> Let me see. Hey! <laughs> no, basketball court is always cracking at Ladera Park. My fondest memory of growing up on this block. Um, well for one, it's really cool because it's a cul-de-sac. <laughs> So to speak, so we were always definitely playing in the street and it was pretty much safe just because all, and the neighbors in this area were just always very friendly, you know what I mean? It's a neighborhood where everyone talks to each other, like we know each other's family and kids and we watch, you know, everyone watches each other's kids grow up and so it was very, um, you know, a close-knit um, circle. This block is actually a really interesting location because it does have its own little hill, you know, my grandparents have a nice view, but it's kind of like the epicenter for like the surrounding cities such as Inglewood, Ladera, even the Baldwin Crenshaw area, like you go one or two lights up and you hit those different locations. Even up until now, like I'll come sometimes here with my father and you know, I call myself trying to learn guitar. Um, so I'll come here uh, sometimes with him and you would never think that a park like this is kind of in the middle of where it's situated. It's peaceful. It's honestly like the perfect location because even the food places like when we didn't drive, like we were able just to walk right down the block. There's 7-Eleven, there's Yee's, which is a super, bomb Chinese food restaurant, Simply Wholesome, which is a really good food spot. So it's just, we were able to have like a little bit of independence, but you know, it was, our parents trusted us, you know, to go to the different areas just because it was kind of right there. So also this is just the house that everyone comes to. This is like home base for all of our family friends as well. So it's like everyone, you know, when it's holiday season or just anyone wants to just stop by just to check in and see what's up with the family. Like literally everyone walks through that back door. So it's like, I don't know, it just always brings me back to like home. Yeah. Just started working in-house in the legal department at Def Jam. And he's looking for somebody to help him out. So I suggested your name. That's how I got in. <laughs>